My name is William Fry and I'm Rural Solutions Managing Director. Rural Solutions is different because we focus really in one sector and one activity. Although we have a multi-faceted service offer, we specialise 24-7 in providing development advice for rural landowners in how to diversify across residential, tourism, leisure and a whole breadth of different ways in which you can generate either income or capital in the countryside. So one of the key things that we are, are working to do is to build a knowledge of existing operational businesses so that we can guide people with much greater certainty around fixed costs, capital costs, operational costs and revenue. And so that we can actually start to take a lot of the risk out of speculative development. We are the only business in the rural sector that is able to provide this information to um, our clients to better their, their future direction. I'm Heather Hancock and I'm a non-exec director at Rural Solutions. So I've got a range of non-exec appointments. I chair a company board, I chair a food standards agency and back in the long history I trained as a land agent, I've managed a national park, uh, worked with lots of rural landowning clients in the past. So I was delighted when in the summer William Fry asked me if I'd join the board. I have huge admiration for Rural Solutions and what I really like about Rural Solutions, what sets them apart, is that they're, they're about business advice for businesses in the countryside. They don't just work with land-based businesses about, oh, you've got an asset, what can we do with it? They start from the point of view of what's the commercial and the economic opportunity in your whole business and then how do you use all of your assets to realise that opportunity. And that's different from most people who specialise in advising um, in the countryside, I'd say. So why as a client would you come to Rural Solutions now particularly? I mean, I'd always come to Rural Solutions because just the sheer quality of what they do and their insight. But this is a moment of great change in the countryside and of great opportunity or threat. You can choose which one of those you want. I'm on the side of how do we realise the opportunity. And to do that, you have to have a much broader view of what the economy is doing, of what the planning system is doing, and really of, of what the job creation and wealth creation opportunities are. Rural are brilliant at that, and I think there's huge opportunity for anybody who's got business or wants business in the countryside to seize the moment and to be planning ahead now.